Pulp Fiction became a massive box office and critical hit after its premiere in 1994. Find out what stars Bruce Willis, Samuel L. Jackson, Uma Thurman, John Travolta and other cast members have been up to since the release of the Oscar-winning film. John Travolta was, of course, already a major star when he was cast as the Francophile hitman Vincent Vega, but his career had taken a bit of a dip before his casting. Pulp Fiction writer-director Quentin Tarantino wanted Michael Madsen for the role, but when he passed in favor of playing Virgil Earp in 1994's Wyatt Earp, the studios insisted Daniel Day-Lewis, who won an Oscar for 1989's My Left Foot, be cast instead. According to the Daily Beast, it was the only role Day Lewis ever actively pursued. But Tarantino had his mind set on Travolta, and the part played a major role in reviving the actor's career. I remember it was a big deal with Miramax, too, because Daniel Day was hotter than heck, and I was colder than Alaska, so the idea that Quentin went for me over Daniel Day Lewis was a very big deal, Travolta told the outlet in 2017. He continued, but I understand now, in retrospect, why he did. By using Uma, me, and Bruce, he balanced it with pop culture, and that wouldn't have happened with Daniel Day or anyone else vying for that part. The role paid off for Travolta, and he received an Oscar nomination for Best Actor in 1995. Travolta followed Pulp Fiction with a hot streak of hits, including the 1995 crime comedy Get Shorty, which earned him a Golden Globe for Best Actor in a Musical or Comedy in 1996. Other notable film credits include Broken Arrow, 1996, Face, Off, 1997, Primary Colors, 1998, Swordfish, 2001, Basic, 2003, Be Cool, 2005, Wild Hogs, 2007, Hairspray, 2007, From Paris with Love, 2010, Savages, 2012, The Forger, 2014, Gotti, 2018, The Fanatic, 2019, and Paradise City, 2022. In 2016, the prolific actor starred on The People v. O.J. Simpson, American Crime Story, receiving an Emmy and Golden Globe nomination for his performance as attorney Robert Shapiro. He was also featured on the short-lived Quibi series Die Hard, co-starring Kevin Hart, in 2020, which was later turned into a movie for Prime Video in 2023. Travolta was married to actress Kelly Preston from 1991 until her death in July 2020. They had three children, Jet, who passed away in 2009, Ella Blue and Benjamin. Samuel L. Jackson as Jules Winfield. Samuel L. Jackson was one of the